Hello, welcome to GTEC Techno Solution Private Limited. We are going to see the bones of cranium in a human skeletal system. So these are the topics that we are going to cover in this session. First we are going to see about the bones of the cranium. Next we are going to see the front and the lateral view of the bones in a skull which includes your frontal, parietal, temporal, nasal, vomer, zygoma, maxilla, mandible and occipital bones. Followed by this, we will be seeing the anterior view of the human skull. If you see, the skull is the most important bone of a human skeletal system. It pro provides protection for the brain and the organs of vision, taste, hearing, equilibrium for a man to stay stable and smell. So these are the important organs for a man. So your skull protects the brain and the organs for your vision, taste, hearing, equilibrium and smell. Hence, your skull is one of the important bone. It also provides the attachment for the muscles that move the head and control the facial expressions and chewing of the food. So the cranium bones are one of the most important bones as they help the woman, the human for survival as it helps the human for eating their food properly by chewing. The skull contains eight cranial bones. The eight cranial bones are as follows. We have one ethmoid bone, one frontal bone, one occipital bone, two parietal bones, one sphenoid bone and two temporal bones. So these are the eight cranial bones which makes the human skull. Next we are going to see the front view of a human skull. So this is how the human skull looks like from the front. Next we have the lateral view of the human skull. So the lateral view of the human skull looks like this. Next we are seeing the frontal bone of the human skull. So this is how the frontal bone looks like from the front view in a human skull. The diagram what you are seeing shows the lateral view of the human skull and the frontal bone in your lateral view is like this. The portion that is shaded in blue is the frontal bone. 
Next we have the front view of the parietal bone of the human skull. There are two parietal bones as you can see on either side of the human skull. The diagram that you are seeing is the lateral view of the human skull showing the parietal bone on the whole. Since there are two parietal bones on either side of the human skull, we have the lateral view showing the exact parietal bone. Next we have the front view of the temporal bone. There are two temporal bones as you can see over here on either side of the human skull and here you are seeing the front view of the temporal bone in the human skull. Next we have the lateral view of the temporal bone in a skull. So the area that is shaded in blue shows the temporal bone. Next we have the nasal bone in the front view of a human skull. The image that you are seeing is the front view which shows the warmer bone located in the human skull over here. Next we have the zygoma bone. There are two zygoma bones on either side of the human in your cheek region and this is the front view of zygomas location in the human skull. Next we have the lateral view of zygoma which is located on either side of the human skull. Our next bone is maxilla. And here we have the front view of maxilla in a skull. Next we have the lateral view of maxilla. The shaded portion is the bone maxilla. Next we have the front view of the bone mandible. The mandible is the second part of the human skull. As you can see, this hole forms the first part and your second part is the mandible which enables chewing of food using the human skull. Next we have the lateral view of the bone mandible. As you can see, the blue region is the mandible bone. Next we have the occipital bone which is shown in the lateral view of a human skull. As you can see the occipital bone is located in the hind side of the skull. The image that you are seeing shows the anterior view of a human skull. 
the anterior view over here shows the major bones that we have seen which includes your parietal bone temporal bone zygomatic bone on either sides maxilla mandible a frontal bone which we have discussed in detail so these are the bones that combine to form a human skull so this anterior view gives you the overview of the bones that are present in a human skull thank you so much for joining gtech on bones of cranium in a human skeletal system